Um, came out of uh, Punta Gorda and I'm now in Miami. Got to enjoy my first day with a bunker biker family. Uh, and I have to admit it was incredible. I got a lot of information. Um, that's it's kind of hard to, to say more than that. All right, light. I um, don't really want to record all my information while I'm sitting still. I guess I'm just going to enjoy downtown Fort Myers. It's a lot different than uh, Orlando, that to say the least. I'm just going to enjoy whatever it is I'm finding here. That would have been fun. Aha! Uh -huh. I was wondering how it jumped from a three hour trip to two hours. It changed on me. Yeah, that's the. That's exactly where I'm going. What the hell? Yeah, I hate that it automatically picks faster routes for you. It's like, no, I'm going to Naples. That's where I'm going. That was the whole point of that route, is to go all the way down to Naples. Because I have tons of time. I uh, just left Naples, Florida. Probably just on the outskirts now. The main city area, probably about less than 10 minutes ago or so. Uh, full on gas. <clears throat> and now I'm heading into the Everglades. Looking forward to a campsite out here. And heading toward the Keys tomorrow. Hoping. I can find a place to sleep. <laughs> right now, it's not looking good, but uh, you know, it never hurts to show up and try. You know, that's what I say. Anyway, I should be at my location or this evening's uh, uh, resting stop in about an hour, give or take some time. Uh, yeah. Let's, let's all uh, enjoy the Everglades. I'll be sure to capture some more footage as it gets more astounding. <laughs> Okay, I see now. Well, I'll leave the camera on until I did. Let's see here, do I want to check over there?
Check out the visit center. Yeah, do you have any spots available? Yeah. Excellent. I'm just doing tent camping. Is that fine here? Yeah. Um, and Careful I, not to leave your food out. Yeah, I was going to ask you, where do I put the food? There's a box down there. I'll take you down and show you for a while. All right. Okay. It's trash. Okay. There's a guy with a motor home that was here. There's one look here, there's a couple more down there. Yeah, it's all fine by me. <laughs> okay, how long are you planning on staying long? Uh it's just gonna be for tonight. Oh that's it, okay. There's a nice little tent spot back in there. Get the fire pit. Yeah, don't have to worry about any uh, animals or anything too crazy? Uh we'll see. See that box right there? Yeah. If you got food and stuff, you lock it up in there. Alright, I'll do that. And then that way you don't put any food in your tent with you. Yeah. <laughs> that's all nobody will bother, especially if you build a little fire or something. Well today I am here at the Mitchell Landing Mitchell Landing uh, Park. It's not too bad. For, uh, or I should say it's the Mitchell Landing Campgrounds. Excuse me. Um, I guess they have areas around here that are for air boating. No running water. Uh, and no showers. But you know, it's $24 a night. Yeah.
Good evening. Just taking the time now to put together my dinner. Hmm. Looks like my stove is almost empty. Still got a little bit left though. Got my camp all set up. I didn't record it this time because there was a rainstorm coming in. I wanted to make sure everything was figured out and kind of trying to do my best to figure out where to camp has been interesting. There's no showers, no running toilets. It's literally just a pit toilet over there, um, which I'm not going to show you. <laughs> just imagine a pit with what looks like a toilet on top, but just the seat. That's more than enough. And the whole room is filled with bugs, so yeah. Um, beyond that, not much really. The ride wasn't too bad. Took a Florida 41. I'm not sure what the higher. Tamiami is what a, I know a lot of the name was, but it goes through the Everglades. It was nice. Uh, my butt is sore. It's day three, so I'm, I definitely noticed that uh, the more days that I have to consecutively, the rougher it is on me. But it's still all right. I sleep well. I actually got here around uh, what's that? One thirty, two o'clock area. And it's just 5 o'clock now, so I've just spent the last few hours just resting, relaxing, uh, trying to mentally prepare myself for tomorrow because I got no cell signal out here, so I can't can't look up anything. Um, I can hope that I someone leaves a message for me. I won't know until I'm basically almost in Homestead, or on the way to Key Largo, uh, which I know is not that far away from here. Um, other than that, I'm just going to enjoy some nature. If we're lucky this evening, it's not overcast, but I don't know if we'll be lucky. Nearest trash can. It's it's a bare trash can, so it's a bit difficult. I don't know if you can even see in there. Yeah, it's stuffed full. To pack all my stuff up into my little gray bag here, and then put it all into a bear box because there are still some creatures around here that might be a little too curious and I don't want to deal with that. There we go. Here's the little bear box. As you can see it has food storage. It tries to tell you what little you can read from there. And you have this super heavy duty door you see just how big that is pretty neat do, 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 do.